Hi, my name is Kirsty and I've been reviewing the Slumber Sack Travel Sleeping Bag. I have a little boy called Jake who is 30 months old and he's been helping me with my review. The difference between the Slumber Sack Travel Sleeping Bag and a normal sleeping bag is the Travel Sleeping Bag has a small hole in the back that you can close with Velcro um, and that allows the harness of a car seat or a buggy to be passed through the sleeping bag so your baby can wear the sleeping bag while they're in the car seat or in the buggy. It means that if your baby falls asleep when they're in the car seat, then you can transfer them easily uh, without waking them into their bed. Um, we've always used a sleeping bag with our little boy. Uh, we just prefer it for safety reasons because there's less chance of him getting tangled in the bed sheets. And it also helps to maintain um, a nice constant temperature throughout the night because he doesn't kick the covers off. Um, the sleeping bag we've been testing is one tog. They come in a range of different togs. There's one tog, two and a half tog, and three and a half tog. The one tog has been perfect for the summer months. Um, we've been testing one that is um, the polka dot design, which is really cute. It's suitable for a boy or a girl. Um, the lining of the sleeping bag is cotton, so it's really nice and soft um, on his skin. Um, I've washed it several times and it washes really well. You can put it in a tumble dryer too and it still looks really nice. Um, I've only got one of the sleeping bags at the moment but I like it so much that I'm actually going to go and buy another one. Um, I have nothing negative to say about the sleeping bag. I, I really like it and I would definitely recommend it to my friends. I hope you found this review useful.